Hey everybody, it's me, Branson Booker. I hope you all had a wonderful Valentine's Day. I know I did. <laughs> Definitely. That was the best night ever. We went to Dave and Buster's. You know, me, you know, you know. Get whatever. But before I get into this review, this review is sponsored by Extremely Delicious Soft Chocolate Chip Cookies. Mmm. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. You can eat them on a plane. You can eat them in a train. You can eat them till you, till you go insane. Extremely delicious chocolate chip cookies. Soft. Chewy. Delicious. Available at your local Jewel Osco. Somewhere in the baker's department. But today, I have a review on this awesome, awesome puzzle. And, of course, you can definitely see who it is. And it's another Simpsons item for my collection. And uh, I haven't really been, do been doing too many Simpsons reviews, but I got another Simpsons review that's actually Bart Simpson related also. And I got that one, I got that souvenir while I was in Florida. And so that's a quick review that I'll do maybe sometime. Eh, I don't know when. I, I know I'll do it, though. I'll get it posted up here on YouTube. In a few uh, weeks, maybe in March, but this is the Simpsons Bart Simpson 1000 piece puzzle, and this is the photo mosaics puzzle. Robert Silver's photo mosaic puzzles. This puzzle, oh, released in 2002 by Buffalo Games, Inc. This is an extremely, extremely sought-after puzzle. Um, I don't see too many of these puzzles. Maybe it's just me, because I really have never seen one of these at all in my lifetime. Uh, maybe it's just me. Maybe they've been out, there's been millions of them floating around, but maybe... I really don't know, but this is the first time I've seen this, and it, it is so cool. I picked this up at a thrift store for like $2. I've never seen these before. Uh, when I get done, I, I'm going to go on eBay and check them out to see if I can find some, but oh my, I've never seen a puzzle like this. Anyway, let's read the back. There's some stuff on the back, so I'll read it. <laughs> Robert Silver's Photo Mosaics. Thousands of mini miniature scenes from The Simpsons combined to make one awesome portrait. That's what makes this puzzle so freaking awesome. Look at that. If you look very, very closely, there are millions of Simpson scenes designed to create this photo. And that's pretty much where the name comes from. Photo, many photos or many scenes, mosaics that turn into big, ginormous pictures when you're finished. This is absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. And then there's a paragraph here about The Simpsons. I'm already at three minutes. For more than a decade, The Simpsons have been making us laugh with their zany antics and outrageous experiences. America was first introduced to... Homer, Marge, Bart, Lisa, and the Citizens of Springfield in a series of animation shorts during the 80s. Uh, Citra, The Simpsons first came out in 1987 on the Tracy Ullman Show. Everybody, every Simpsons fanatic knows about the Tracy Ullman Show. That basically kickstarted The Simpsons. And then it goes in to say that they got their big break in 1989 with the roasting on open fire. Then 1990 led to the series and yada, 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 yada. Up in 2002, the Simpsons have been America's favorite family. Basically, that's it. Oh, and here's Homer saying, uh, It's been a lifelong dream to appear on a Buffalo Games jig jigsaw puzzle. Two thou almost 2,000 pieces. And then this is a little something about the creator, Robert Silvers. But this puzzle is so cool in a way that it takes basically 
I don't know how many scenes are in this. I really haven't looked at the pieces, but we're gonna I'm gonna do it just for you all so you guys can see. So we're gonna open it up. Now I got this at the thrift store. So um basically, um I guess all the pieces seem to be in here. Look how small these pieces are. I'll take one out, but they come in this big bag. Here's a big uh, picture of what Bart is supposed to look like when you're all finished. Oops. That's awesome. Says The Simpsons. I may, I might actually hang this up instead of actually build the puzzle. <laughs> Cause it's gonna take a long time, so I might just hang this up just because. <laughs> I might. It looks awesome. Nice poster. What else is in here? Uh, a product warranty is in here. I don't really know why they put it in here, but there's a product warranty for a puzzle. Now I'll take one of these pieces or a couple of these pieces out and show you all this is their actual size. It's this small. There are 2,000 of these very, very small pieces. <laughs> Two freaking thousand of them. Of these very, very small pieces. And if you can see, you can see Bart and who is, is that Bart and Lisa? Let me see. These are extremely small. Seems Homer and Lisa right there. It's not really that good, but... Oh, yeah, this is Bart. Bart, Lisa, and Homer. But that's how small they are. And they're miniature scenes. Uh, here's that. This one's not that good. Let me see if I can find another, another one. Here's Bleeding Gums Murphy. Let's see if I can get him in a shot. There's Bleeding Gums, I think from Mona Lisa, Moaning Lisa. That's a scene from there. But there's just millions. There's millions, and that kind of brings me to the downside of this puzzle. This is a freaking awesome puzzle. But with 2,000 pieces that look this small, you can basically see where my downside comes. And if you lose any of these 2,000 pieces... A couple of these, a hundred of these, if you lose them, you're basically screwed. These are very small pieces. Um, they can get very lost easily. A kid can easily swallow them. Obviously, that's why they said this is for ages 12 and up. But a kid can swallow the pieces. They can get lost. They're really small and very tiny, and there's a lot of them. So if you miss a couple, you really can't finish this big picture that is supposed to come out to be because basically all the pieces are lost. Uh, another thing is there is no instructions on how to build it. Obviously, like all jigsaw puzzles, put this back, you have to sit down, you have to actually have a time to sit down and put this whole darn thing together. I'm not a jigsaw person, for, jigsaw puzzle person for that reason, but those of you who are probably don't mind sitting down, dumping all of these out, but once again, make sure you don't lose them, and putting this thing together piece by piece by piece by piece. You gotta do with this with about five people to at least get this whole thing done. And it does take a while, because there's millions of scenes, and that's an, kind of another downside. You have to match every little scene to each piece, and it, it, it'll take you it'll take you more than a day to do this it'll take you maybe a whole day or uh, two days it'll take you more than 30 minutes or 45 minutes it's not one of those kitty puzzles this is like an adult puzzle it, it will take you some time to to turn into this oh my goodness but those of you who can handle it those of you who actually like sitting down and besides playing on your phone like sitting down and doing creative constructive puzzles this is for you i had to pick it up because well the poster's in there so i can just put that up but this is a really unique puzzle i love how they use 
little scene from The Simpsons. It is so cool. And maybe one day, not likely, but maybe one day I can sit down and actually put this freaking thing together because I bet it'll look amazing in person than it does on the photo. So, if you can find this, Simpsons fans, 90s fans, if you can find this on eBay or on Amazon or wherever, pick this up. And even if you can't put the puzzle together, I mean, it's still some a great collectible to have. This is the Simpsons Photo Mosaics 2000, it says 1000, but it's really 2000, 2000 piece Bart Simpson puzzle. This is a very, very unique puzzle. If you find it, pick it up. You will be extremely pleased with it. And if you can put it together, leave a comment in the blocks below because I want to see how long it took you to do it. So, if you if you buy this and you put it together, message me or something because I know I can't do it. But thanks for watching, guys. Bye.